Hi everyone, and welcome back to the second episode of the stream. We haven't got anywhere on Twitch, but uh, we're back on YouTube. We split up. There we go. Welcome back. Exactly. You've got to say welcome back to YouTube because everyone that watches on YouTube um, has to has to wait between the instalments. Whereas if you come on the stream, you can see them all at the same time. There you go. Uh, okay. And just up that a little bit. Exactly. Come come join you on you from YouTube. Come say hello. <laughs> Okay, doors, there's copper, you can just use iron. Fill in the doors. And all those are filling in. Oh, and I've also cancelled that. Exactly, and it's completely free. We need is a Twitch account. <laughs> Guess we've also got to fill these areas too. And I have I have no idea what these areas are gonna be, so. Fill them with drywall for now. Just like, yeah, dupes don't have enough to do. Uh, does that come down there? I think that comes down here, right? Oh no, it kind of comes across. I don't know. It's a bit weirdly asymmetrical. Uh, okay, we'll just put some ladders up there. That should be fine. Okay, we're just painting along. Do, do, do. Oh, we need to paint this area too. There we go. I say paint, you know, we're, we're drywall painted. Two million calories. Yeah, they always starve. I don't know why. Oh, it's Kaynord. Why is Kaynord starving? This should be grounded. Get out of here. Ooh, no silly bugs in the rockets. They are allowed to eat, they're just being being annoying. Annoying dupes. Annoying dupes being annoying. Normal stuff. Yeah, so I'm guessing then our outbound hoids are there and there. Maybe. It seems very close. Anyway. No, 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 it's not. It's not that. They were just getting stuck in the rockets. Where's Wolf Rat? Unreachable. Has he got himself stuck somewhere? I suspect. And these guys are prioritizing building and not digging the right stuff. Whoops. They they do. Yeah, you see, the thinking time is now actually uh, affecting them. Okay, we're doing some some peeing on here as well. There we go. I mean, I told them to build first so they didn't get stuck. So I I, I honestly don't know how they actually managed to do that. They're all fine. Just a little bit of pee. Uh, these tubes. I mean, I tried. I even tried. I, I gave them the priority of building so that they would get their ladders done first and then they can't get stuck. Right. Oh, dog's body is... Oh, God. Let me get this done as well. These juice. <laughs> uh, no dead juice for now. Yeah, we only have a couple on this run. We're doing too bad. Uh, Three thousand cycles. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, I, no, I think the um, the thinking time is is entirely dependent on how many you've got. Um, the law inspector for fail series, Colin. Ooh. Yeah, I did try and briefly cover the law. I didn't go into that much detail, I don't think, on that tutorial bite, but... Yeah, 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 well they're like little clone things, aren't they? They're not like full people. Anyway. Ah... Uh, it just me they feel like they've done very little. I think what they've actually done is built all the ladders that they could possibly reach, so... If it feels like they haven't done very much, I think it's because they've just been building ladders. The longest colony is over 1800. Yeah, yeah, I mean, in general it's easier just to move stuff and rebuild, generally. But, um, if you go that long, then I think there's also another driver just to 
want to start another run. I can feel that. Yeah, they're they're like they're made of uh, genetic ooze. They are prints, yeah. That's why it's a printing pod because you print them. Okay, this is still broken, but it's still nice and chilly inside. So, A lovely sleep wheat is being collected by our sweepies. Almost sounds like a tongue twister there. Sleep wheat, sleepy, sleep wheat, sweepies. There we go. Try saying uh, sleep, sleep wheat, sweepies three times fast and. Uh, yeah, have a fun time with that. What's uh, what's entombed? What what do what do? You... <laughs> yeah, I struggled with what I tried to say quickly. It says entombed on here, but I have not. I have no entombed warning, unless I've hidden something. I have no idea. Okay, all right. I think we're in a bit of a waiting game right now. We should only weigh 30 kilograms and carry tons. Yeah, I mean, they're, they're carrying capacity. But then, I don't, maybe it's something to do with their magic gun. Because they have a magic gun that just builds stuff and digs stuff. And, you know, that's... Maybe the dupes aren't actually that good. They just they just have a really good gun. There's, there's a lot of things you can do with a magic gun, you know. Okay. Uh, yeah, so, right, the other thing, what if we've got some downtime? Effectively, we have downtime whilst they do um, a building. The, the thing I wanted to have a quick look at, which I probably should have done in my own time, but I uh, haven't anyway, is uh, is these buildings. And then what I'll do, I need to make a list over here. Right, aquarium, sporkage room. Okay, cuddle pip room. Oh, I also wanted, can I just put down marble blocks and make them the mushroom one? Are they going to be... Do I... What can I make them out of? Only these two? Oh, decor 20%. Let's try. I'm just going to make a room full of... full of marble blocks. If I can get the mushroom one. The mushroom one's terrible quality. So I don't know if having my good artist do it would will work. Yeah, the, don't ask how the magic... Peace bringer gun works. It it, it it just works, you know. I think you're going down a rabbit hole on that. Let's see, because obviously Leo is a masterworks artist. Uh, I can't that's just skills called master. Oh, it is masterworks. There you go, masterworks artist. So I don't know if I can actually turn this into a terrible quality, um, terrible quality artwork. I hope I can. Yeah, well, actually, Leo's not even the one uh, uh, doing it. Let's see. Yeah, I know you can redecorate it, but I don't know if you if you have a masterworks dupe do it. Can you redecorate it to a terrible quality one? And if you do, what quality does it end up being? I don't know. I don't know how that works. Um, okay, so right, I need a water cooler. I'm just making some notes here. Water cooler with bracken if we want to get. So, so the question is, how do we get the maximum morale? And it comes with all these annoying things. So the jukebox is, we've already got one. Arcade cabinet, we can just slap one down, although it does do so much power that I haven't done that yet. Right. The espresso machine, this is a right pain because it needs... Okay, all right. It's not too bad. Um, the espresso machine needs pincher. Isn't too bad. And water, but okay. The hot tub needs... What does it need? Uh... It needs warm water, but I think we already have that. So that's that's fine, not too big. The uh, the surfboard needs water again. So we need some water up here. Right, the sauna, I've never built a sauna, a working one anyway. Um it needs steam, so uh, um maybe some actual insulation would be helpful here, otherwise we're gonna have some heat problems, I don't know. Uh, uh, hold on. Okay, still starving even though there's like food everywhere. Oh, more dupes. Problem is, I think actually, <gasps> shuffle legs. Yes. Okay, definitely taking the shuffle legs. The more dupes we print, I think the slower they get at doing stuff. So. Oh, look, we have two shuffles. See, our original, um, 
my original one, who is currently starvation run, uh, minimum feed ranching. Yeah. But I think he was too old. I think he was too old when he started. Let's see, because this is 1.7. 1.7 times 40 is... No, it's too little. This guy's going to die. Um, yeah. We may, as well, uh, we may as well kill this guy now. He's not going to make it. Whereas this one, this one, because he was the original one that we tamed, but he was wild. Does this have meat on it? Is it you going to collect that? Oh. Disabled by automation grid. Okay. Not the best system. Anyway. Yeah. Uh, yeah, so this guy, he will be added to the large pile of food. This guy um, was from a baby, so he was tamed from the start. So he'll start working on his second egg much earlier and then we'll be fine. And then it looks like we've got another Volp up here, which is good. So we've now gone from from one Volp to two. Uh, and we've now just got another three out of the printing pod, so that is good. That will help us out. Yeah, you see the dupes are still... I don't know why they're, they're so intent on filling this up. There's like a million tasks for them to do. <gasps> oh, that's so good. That's right, Leo. If we had that, then... We wouldn't need that. High pumpkin pie as well. Um, Yeah, we, we wouldn't... Yeah. Well, we're going to need some bracking anyway, so I suspect a gassy moo ranch is on the cards. Because if we really want that maximum morale, then uh, we will need the bracking for the water cooler for that extra plus one. Okay, here's, so we've got a nice mermaid. This is the problem, right? The, the mushroom is the, is the rubbish one. Uh, so I can't, uh, I can't let the normal artists uh, do that because they'll, they'll make it too nice. But we'll see. Um, here's what we'll do. Here's what we'll do. So we'll put these across. This is my. This is now my uh, marble room. Although they don't fit. I thought these were even. Weren't these meant to be sixteen? No, they were third. Okay. Great. I hate asymmetry. So what we'll do? We'll do that. Um, we'll not let anyone. Okay. We'll, 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 uh, no one's coming in. And pumpkin pie, thank you much for gifts. Uh, oh, thank you, uh, Lady A, for gift serving uh, pumpkin pie. There you go. You guys know each other. Appreciate it. Um, yeah, what we'll do is we'll we'll, ac we'll limit access, and then the first dupe I can find, who's gonna be not a new dupe. I want an older dupe because they can carry more stuff. Um, like. Joe. Oh, he's uncultured. I need to do someone that can decorate. Is there anyone that can decorate that's not terrible? I think it was zero. Is creativity skill zero? If I put George on this, let's see, have a sec. You're going to have the mushroom. <laughs> hey, thank you very much, guys. Appreciate all of the subs and the support. Been amazing this year, and I hope it continues. You're very, all very generous and very kind. Uh, caretaker is fine. Caretaker George. I don't think he has. Yeah, okay. Awesome. He doesn't have the art skill, so that means uh, he can make a hash of these. Hopefully. Oh God, I've got to find him in this list. I hate this list. Why isn't this list alphabetical? Can I can I make it alphabetical? Okay, now it's it's reverse alphabetical. I mean, that's something. Not really what I wanted, but close enough. There we go. Yeah. We love George. Uh, is a to save is a hunt list for dedicated only players. What do you mean by that? Uh, oh, I've missed some of you guys chatting. Yeah, six wide, six more between. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, there we go, right. I could zoom out all the way, pumpkin pie. Yes, this is 
This is what it looks like currently. That, I need to go that far out to get it all on the screen. There's a quick uh, snapshot of what we're looking at currently. I think it's looking pretty good. It's coming out where I'd hoped it would be. I'm just going to fill this. Yes. Let's see what George does with these. Um, it is mushroomy. Uh, so, right, let me go back to my list. So I put, I put steam, sauna steam, um, juicer, right? The juicer is a right pain because we need mushroom, bristle berry, mule lice, and water. So juicer means I'm going to need to plant mealwood, bristle berry, and uh, mushrooms. Great. I also gonna have to size these because we have to basically make a little wild farm to, to to sort this. Okay. The soda fountain needs carbon dioxide. Soda fountain. That I mean that should be easy to supply. The dupes are making enough of that. Okay. The beach chairs will go at the top. So what I want to do I can already do this. I want this top room to be these top rooms to be sun lounger rooms. And ideally, I'd love it if we can get some sand in here. Um, might be a bit tricky to do. Uh, I think if we, hmm, we need to superheat some, um, some, some dirt. No, uh, we'll see, we'll have a look at that. Let's keep going, let's keep going. Sorry, I've lost the chat for a sec because I'm writing some notes. The wind tunnel doesn't need anything, right? It just needs power. Party line's fine, and the rest of it is just decor stuff. Uh, the monument also needs to go in. I guess we should put the monument in on one of these sides. That also means we need a lot of uh, stuff to build it with, but... Okay, there we go. Sorry, sorry back to chat. Uh, you should feed them all mushrooms. No, 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 because this is a luxury hotel, so they have to have frost burgers. Um, <laughs> space magic. Uh, new optimal... The ultra right size to keep it as small as possible. Instead of full size. Huh? What do you mean? What optimal rush design? What about? Let's see. I want to see George actually uh, carve one of these and see if we can get a get a mushroom. Ah, I see chat is now theorizing about what the what the duplicate gun is. Do you guys have any any suggestions? Uh, leave us a comment on YouTube as well. What do you guys think? We should have another egg now. There's the fourth egg. Lovely. Okay. This guy will also give us an egg fairly soon. Well, I mean, the plants are actually... actually one. Yeah, what do, what do you mean? Do you know about the gun? What do you think this thing is? I mean, it's a it's a handheld device that shoots things. <laughs> I just describe that as a gun. You can call it a multi tool if you want. It has the power to destroy and dig and build. I come from Ratchet and Clank. Are you king there? I've never actually played Ratchet and Clank. I'll admit. I mean, it, it just shoots stuff, so I, yeah, I'd call it a gun. 96 room size plus hotel is 10 critter a pot. Three rooms... 36. Huh? Leo, I, I'm, I'm lost on what you're trying to... You're trying to convey. <laughs> You've lost me. Allergic reaction, building in two men, yeah. Okay, um, I mean, I think here they are making progress, but they are making damn slow progress. Mental capacity, I have gun. Now, you guys can argue this is not a gun, but I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm sticking with that this is a gun, which either shoots nuts and bolts or like magic deconstructing rays or digging rays or. Is it definitely a gun by my definition? Does that make this game like you should add a add a PG rating, Peggy rating to this? As a as a violence of gun 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 violence on on solid tiles. Right. Anyway, 
Yeah, I I did just give them a lot to do, so. Is our, oh, I think our rocket's back as well, so. Let's keep a quick eye on that. We just needed to refuel it. Uh, let's see. All right, 50-50 odds on it being this one or this one. I'm kind of tempted to go this way. And also just send it, because I think we should be. Just to have enough oxygen and food. Nice. Classic fungi, indeed. <laughs> the dupes do love endangering themselves. I mean, it's not just a laser. It's more than a laser. Sometimes it's a laser. Sometimes it's not a laser. That's true. I mean, that is that is innocent animal murder, and and I as a doubt if you snuck in. Cool. So let's send that off. And I mean, I'm hoping these two are the two planetoids, and I'm hoping this is the right one. So we'll find out. We'll find out. But uh, I think it's taking shape. We could also um, do... I've well, run out of glass. Okay, we should do more glass. So how does Slick just keep getting out here? I'm guessing Dupe's dropping them when they're running in. Yeah, our, uh, our shovels are filling up slowly and hopefully if we can get the, um, find the regular planetoid we can make that even quicker. Right, because they said controls on it. Oxygen is not great. Gas wise this planetoid is a bit of a mess and there's no suit. <laughs> Focus shell kind of doesn't count. Yeah, they're a bit of a pain. You just haven't used petroleum engines. But petroleum engines are the best engines, in my opinion. They might work. Well, okay. Best is, is the wrong word. They're my favourite engines. Because they're so damn convenient. Move command with critters. I mean, it's great. I love the move command with critters. It makes things a lot easier. So I'm all for that. All for making life easier. Okay. I mean... <laughs> You, you, there's an argument between the Rad Bolt and the Hydrogen. I think objectively the Hydrogen is the best engine. But I can see why people like the Rad Bolt engine. And it is almost as good. It's very close to as good. Um, assist if someone's dropped it. Yes. Oh, yeah. Yeah, well, that, that, clearly that doesn't happen when you have the incubator deliveries, but... There you go. Yeah, how long do you think it's going to take three dupes to do this? Maybe we're a bit over ambitious. I mean, they have already. I feel like they've cleared out a bit of a chunk here. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I'm being optimistic. They haven't really done that much, have they? 50 cycles? Oh, jeez. We send more dupes. Send more dupes. Using the finish up mod. Never heard of it. Rap bolt is freer than the hydrogen. That is true. It is much easier to generate rap bolts. We just let this water geyser go as well. I don't think we need to. Got enough water. The lovely bristle blossoms are growing away. Finally back home. Tomorrow's gonna be the boring day. Oh, well, I'm glad you're home anyway. Uh, you can you can always take my vods. Spend uh, spend hours and hours with me, whichever run you want. Printables. Yeah, I'm on the printable printable taking train tonight. I think. And next up is we got a good jeep. Re it becomes Elray Rod. There we go. Thank you, Elray Rod, for supporting the channel. Okay, so we're almost to the end of the original list of people that were uh, on the list before the series started and very early on. So then we come on to the people weren't on that list. Uh, I need George to come do this. 
There you go. Well, I'm glad I can keep you company. Uh, no, 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 rad bolts. Well, I don't, it depends. If you've got a nuclear reactor, they become really easy. Ah, okay, he, George needs a skill, okay. I forgot he needs something to do that. Schedule block dislodge dupes to take a new task. Uh, I don't know, it doesn't seem that helpful. Well, will just add another um, downtime slot. And also you get more, more um, morale from that. With the react, yeah, exactly. That's the thing. I mean, rad bolts are really easy to do if you have a nuclear reactor. So that's kind of the key. If you don't, actually, kind of comes a bit of a pain. Uh, and Rena five, or is that Rena's? What's that? Uh, yes, thank you very much for coming, and saying hello. So many people from YouTube today. Always good. Um, some gloves. There you go. Right, here goes George. I want some sort some dodgy mushrooms, that's what we want. Uh, uh -huh. That's the one I wanted. Okay, I've only got one. I think you can... <laughs> this is just going to be a room full of absolutely horrendous mushrooms. Uh, I love it. That's great. Should we make this... This will probably be the thumbnail for this episode. Should we do that? I'll just do the... <laughs> <laughs> exactly, we gotta have the shrooms, but it's a it's a terrible quality carving, so I can only do this. Um we can also finish this room out with crown mod. I mean it's horrendous and glorious at the same time, I love it. <laughs> uh, and then we'll we'll put an actual like good one in. I think um I can't remember if it was the metal one or the non metal ones that had was there some kind of mushroomy thing? I'll try to do Thank you. Thank you, Rena, for the follow. Appreciate it. And guys, if you aren't followed, I mean, smash that follow button. That's what we'd like saying. Um, it is entirely free on Twitch. Just like subscribing on YouTube. Uh, and subscribing is not free, but I appreciate you for doing gifting away subs, Lady A. <laughs> Very generous of you. Exactly. Everyone's come over from YouTube. Great. Um, yeah, so so if you have a nuclear reactor, um, Al, Alpha Cobra, Alpha Cobra, sorry, um, it makes loads of nuclear waste, and so then you just compress the nuclear waste using like an infinite storage technique. And then you, uh, then it makes it super easy to uh, generate rap bots. So it just infinitely compresses them. So you can make, you know, so many per cycle. Okay, uh, priorities. Right, we'll take George off that. There we go. And uh, allow everyone into the room again. There we go. And that's, that's great. I love that. That's definitely going on the thumb now. <laughs> As if you've clicked on this episode, you wondered where it came from. There you go. Okay, right, Adios is coming out here. Uh, hopefully, I really hope it's this. If it's not this, we're on a bit of a goose chase. Yes. Welcome people from YouTube. Uh, and hopefully everyone's having an awesome Christmas. Um, I was gonna say, uh, this may be the last stream before Christmas. I'm not sure I'm gonna be able to stream next week. Or at least currently, I have no, actually, um, no, no, sorry, that's not true. I want to try and get one stream in before, uh, one stream in next week, but I probably won't be able to stream the week between Christmas and New Year is what I should say, so, um, let's see. Why is Nuclear Waste such a good coolant? Because it has an extremely high specific heat capacity club step, that's why, and welcome in. So, uh, the Aquatuna takes off, the the heat energy an Aquatuna removes depends on the specific heat capacity of the, of the liquid, because it always takes 14 degrees. Supercoolant's better, um, with a specific heat capacity of 8.4. Water's 4.2 and nuclear waste is about 6. Uh, what day of the week? Um, well, uh, before Thursday is the answer. Go for dough. I, I'm guessing that's going to mean Wednesday, but um, I will, I'll let you guys know on, on YouTube. But um, I was thinking about trying to do a double stream or something to try and get enough VODs to, to go over the 
the Christmas period, but uh, it's, it's going to be difficult to fit that in. That means I need to stream two days next week or do a six hour um, go or something. I don't know, maybe we can stream four hours or something. I, I don't know. Yeah, I'd, I'll have a think about it, but I'd, I probably don't want to stream two different days. I think that's going to be too much. Um, so we'll see. It's easy. Yeah. I, I, to be honest, I kind of, I find the, um, uh, what should we do? I quite like that one. I think that's, I think that's the right one. The, uh, the battle masterpiece. Uh, yeah, well, I, to be fair, I used to play like that. But, um, yeah, stre streaming's a bit different. I mean, streaming, streaming only takes a lot more effort and, uh, intentionality than just playing by yourself, you know, that's the thing. So you've got to bear that in mind. Doing a, doing a six hour stream is not the same as doing a six hour only play session. Um, but also, I don't know, I kind of feel like, um... I wouldn't do a six hour only session anymore. Oh, I, I, do, I gotta admit, actually, I don't play that much only, <laughs> even though I make all of these things for it. Um, do the grub grub one, but yeah, I want, I want the person, I think the dupe better. Yeah, well, it's not, it's not just that. It's just like, I'm just playing by yourself. Like I can have music on and stuff. I like, I play with no music. So, um, because I, I like to try and keep it open and things so that you guys can, if you want to put music over the top of me, you can, that kind of thing. Um, but yeah, if I was playing by myself, I'd put music on and I could pause and get up and, you know, I could, if I was bored, watch a YouTube video in the middle and come back and, you know, you, yeah. and it's also all of the, all of the like talking and narrating and stuff, which I think is important for a stream. Um, no, it takes a uh, takes effort to do that. Okay, I think we have to put in some ladders over here, and then your might be a bit interesting to try and deconstruct this later. But we'll see. We'll give it a go because there's no access to this side. Okay. Uh, oregano thousand cycles. Well, that's good. I mean, that's a good job. So congratulations. And hopefully you got the the clay thing where they, they should give you a, a positive message after 2000 cycles. So that's good. Well done. And uh, yeah, thanks for popping in. Come and say hello. Um, <laughs> you guys are, you guys are a delight. Uh, it makes it much more, much more interesting. Uh, yeah, I do have to pay attention to what you guys are doing and uh, interact. Which is, it's fun, it's fun, but it, it's something else to think about, but definitely fun. Uh, do we have our two dupes here? Okay. Oh, caretaker's in bed, love it. Um, I might be able to. Probably Severa, but anyway, it's fine. Uh, more fun playing more people. Yeah. Okay, right, assistant care is on it. Hopefully this is a planetoid. Come on, planetoid. It is. Ah, nice. And it is the one we wanted too, which is perfect. Okay, looks like we're going here first. Hmm. That's interesting. I'm I'm tempted to go telescope uh, telescope. Telescope this one as well and see if it is there, because that would be unusual, but um I don't see how it can be anywhere else unless it's somewhere in here. Possibly over here. Could be that one. Maybe it's that one. Hmm. This is this is an odd star map. Lovely. But yeah, this is the one we wanted, so that's the main thing. Let's see if we can steal some shove voles. It's gonna be the main thing. Do you guys let only play in the background? Uh never. Never Dasmich. Oh my god. The amount of times that the dupes would just try and murder themselves is uh Far too high. So we do. We, I don't do that. I do not do that. Even though I mean my bases are fairly stable, I'd say. I mean probably more stable than most. 
particularly like this, like if I just left, should be fine. But the thing is, like my my food could just break again or something, something like that. And then you run out of calories, and then everyone dies, <laughs> you know. Or if I left these guys on this planetoid, they'd probably find a way to get themselves stuck again. Even though I told them to do all of the um, the building first, they'd probably still manage it. So, I yeah, don't, don't trust dupes at all. <laughs> that is a big mistake. Yeah, I think I think we probably need some more dupes over here. But then we don't really have room for bedrooms and food and stuff. Uh, we can definitely add another one of those in. Let's, uh, I tell you what, let's preemptively move this over. Still great hall. Preemptively move this over. We could add some more. This should be three per dupe. Uh, let's see. And I think, I think the light has to hit the plant and not the tile. So I think that's the limit there. Yeah, let's, uh, let's, let's prep for maybe another dupe would help. We might, let's take a quick look at the skills as well. You guys have a quick peek here because usually I don't do it. Um, and uh, Raghadu, thank you very much for the subscription. Appreciate that. Very kind of you. Um, what do credit ranching? This is you. This is a very common combination for me. Credit ranching. Uh, I always go with that. Doctor, there you go. Uh, we've got another researcher. Why don't we take another researcher? There you go. Uh, bottom tile of the plant is enough. You have the plant, yes, but not the, if it's just the tile and not the plant, then it won't count, right? Uh, let's take that. There's a lot of likes this guy. Okay. Two. I would I would like some more diggers ideally, um, but uh, I'm only gonna give diggers if they have ah, lovely. Oh, we have a lot of uh, skills we could give here. And say these guys will be eventually um, guests in the hotel, so their skills won't matter. But uh, for now, it kind of is important. So, uh, Kane or yeah, it doesn't really matter. They don't have okay. We've got a lot of artists for some reason. Don't know why. It takes so much time. So you start the mid game. Start the mid game. I I find they take loads of time in the end game. The end games, I spend all my time. Uh, yeah. So we'll take ranches for now. We say we have to work out a way to replace these ranches. Uh, but I mean, I suppose when they become hotel guests, they can keep their hats. Okay, that's it. I mean, yeah, we really do need diggers because. There's a lot of hard stuff, abyssalite, things like that. Uh, inverted triple V-shaped bristle bluffs. Ooh. That's clever. So, so you're saying rather than have them flat, have like a, well, like a, a V, like a, um, like a triangle. Um, yeah. The, um, so Alpa, Alpa, Alpa Karaba. Tell me if I'm saying it right, Alpa Karaba. Um, the hats don't do anything, so they don't give them extra skills or anything like that. The, what I do, the hats tell me when I have, um, I want some diggers. Uh, the hats tell me when I've, I've kind of skilled them up enough. And uh, let's see, welcome in, slide plays. There we go. Almost through this list, like I said. So yeah, I, I use it as a helpful reminder to myself uh, what we need to do. Hmm. Very slow. Yeah. I mean, I I have a huge issue with the the flat the flat ones. The light the lights don't take a lot of power. They do make a little bit of heat, but if you're farming. Bristle blossoms long term. You really need a cooling system anyway, so it's it's fine. So I suppose you could. 
Save a little bit. Well, I need the... Uh, the rocket. Okay, we'll just quickly get into orbit there. Okay. Yeah, the gas piping is a bit of a nightmare. Because the thing is, what we've also got to do is... Uh, free some of these up. <laughs> we can do. We can just open the um, the hydrogen. It should all end up in here, I think. Maybe we'll just put uh, one mesh tile there. Okay. Right. I've given them a lot to do. We'll just wait for them to do it, I think. So... Uh, no, no, they didn't put that on in the end. It, takes them, it might take them a little while, but priority inflation, everything becomes. Yeah, I, yeah. I mean, well, we know there's a meme where I just make everything priority nine, so. We're fine, we're fine. A single opportunity using a leader effect to cool the turbine more. Yeah, I mean, I think generally it's more efficient to cool the plants and just pump in hot water. Especially if you're getting it from like a really hot geyser. So it's way more energy to cool the incoming water than cool the um Ooh, they're not gonna be able to get up here. Okay. Uh we have to do a little little redesign. Uh Oh it would yeah. Don't know what's wrong with my head today, but I, I'm struggling to visualize stuff. Yeah, we'll do that to that. If we do that to that, oh no, yeah, then we should probably put a a little one in there. Okay. Three priorities, five, nine, and uh, yeah. Yeah, well, that. Uh, cool steam vent is heated by the tuna. Hmm. Yeah. The imminent hassle to survive. Mm hmm Yeah, yeah. Well, I'd say, I think we've kept the priorities in check, so I'm not doing too badly. And because I have so many dupes, it makes it easier as well. Don't have to worry too much. Okay, right. A couple of seconds before we can get... Uh, what's that called? Bill Tina. That sounds just really weird. Okay, deploy. Um, ooh. Let's see how high are we dealing with. So if our rocket is 37. Oh god, this is a very deep valley. Um, should we come down here or should we land more up top? I don't know. I don't know. I'm, I'm tempted to land more up the top because... What is that? That's 45. Alright, well that's very, that's very low. Okay, well that makes things easy. Um, okay. So here's what we're going to have to do. Annoyingly, we're going to have to level all this off. And I also need some mafic rock. Oh, there's a bit of mafic rock there. That valley is, is too low. It is, it's very low. Oh yeah, so I want the shove hole, so... Are either of these guys ranchers? You need to, you need to be a rancher to move them, don't you? I didn't, didn't I didn't think about that, did I? Whoops. Who's unreachable food? Dog's body. What do you mean unreachable food? Oh, for God's sake! I told you this. You, you can't you can't leave dupes alone. They're still digging as well. Uh, granite, granite. And has a deep freeze with a thermoregulator. Nice. Good job, good job. Sounds like everything's going well. Uh, I'll take tubes for granite. Oh, that's terrible. I, that, that is terrible. Uh, okay, right. Uh... 
Where's he gone? Is this bugged? Are we bugged? No. They're just asleep. Did you guys... Or can I not deploy, or...? Did that... Did that do it? Do I have to watch or something? What's... Okay, right. Something weird happened there. Okay, and deploy the second one. We good, right. Oh, Nuki Nucleus also come from the land of YouTube. So many people tonight. But welcome, welcome across. Thank you very much for the, the kind words. Yeah, the, um, the thinking time is starting to get a bit long now. Taking too many dupes, I think. Okay, we'll flatten this off. Uh, if three water guys isn't plastic for Trekos. You guys uh, seem a bit hesitant on going to other planetoids. You've got to get on the rocketry stuff. It's not too bad. At least it in, well, it's based on DLC anyway. Okay, we've got to get this mafic done, please. Right, and then rocketry. Just slap that here. Yeah, you see there's, there's thinking time when they, they do one and then have to think about the other one. I mean, this adds a genuine in-game delay to their, their doing tasks. Okay. Can shovels eat metal? They can eat iron ore, MK person. So it's iron ore, dirt, or regolith. Those are the three that they can eat. Okay. Should be fine to do that. Mm -hmm. Oh no, we're getting sunburnt. Quick. Okay, seems like head caretaker is prioritizing D. Uh, land, 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 land. Okay, uh, and one of these guys needs uh, needs ranching skill to do. That. I think it's going to be uh, head caretaker that takes it because we're going to need to move these guys in. Didn't want to be stranded because of random chance, huh? Uh, they're fine. Okay, they can go inside. Oh, also, because I've got a... I have a telescope in here. They can uh, keep telescoping. Also, I didn't bring any more rad pills. Maybe <laughs> should make some more rad pills. Where's the apothecary? I've got... Oh, where did I chuck the apothecary? In here? Or somewhere outside? Out here? <laughs> I don't remember. Where? Where's the apothecary? Is there a way to find, like, search this map? Um, where? Does anyone remember? Because cause I sure as hell don't. I thought it would have been here. Or in here. But I can't see it either of them. Colony? Yeah, but I... Mm, mm, I think it tells you how many you've got, but not how to find it. Did I put it in here somewhere? It's got to be on power, right? So, it's got to be on a power line somewhere. I have no idea. I'm pulling a complete mind blank on this one. No, uh, yeah. I just, just build another one. You do make, you make rap pills in the apothecary, right? I'm not going mad. Try that. Anyway, right, in the meantime, I think we are, what we want to do is net all of those, so, and I could use the moving command, but uh, that means I'd have to manually find them all, which would be a bit of a pain. So, what I want to do is get across here, 
Uh, two, two. So we'll come down in twos. Do you reckon we can get we can get all the way across here? I don't know. Um, no. There we go. Okay, we're just using our uh, movement knowledge so we can. Uh, we can do the minimum amount of digging. There we go. There you go, something like that. Uh, <laughs> sorry, Das Mitch, you wrote, you wrote a mini essay, sir. Um, slugs can't eat steel and opium. Okay, good. Uh, that's what you're saying. Challenge to reach somewhat stable base. Yeah. <laughs> well, I'm glad the uh, the tutorials are helping. That's what they're there for. That's why I made them. Um. Mm hmm. It's um. Yeah, it is. Uh, it's really great when you crack rocketry. I think. It's, uh, it's like a watershed moment. It, uh, you know, it changes, changes a lot. That's a geyser. Um, all the green jelly chips to make your dupes glow green. You need to take the. Well, I mean, yeah, I mean, I don't know if that counts as glowing green, but you can make them green by uh, exposing them to too much radiation because you're not very careful. Um, if you want them to actually glow green, there is a there is a trait. I think it's called Radiation Eater. Can someone um, anyone want to correct me on that? What the actual name is? But I think it's is it Radiation Eater or like glowing or something? Yeah. So there is a trait which makes the dupes radioactive, but it's quite a rare one. So that's that's the best tip. Glow stick, glow stick, rad eater. Does ra does rad eater go with glow stick? Okay. Some combination of that is probably close. That's the tip. Uh, okay. Is it just me or is this going really flipping slowly? I should probably keep an eye over here. Oh, we've got a nice radioactive ore field. Not that we're ever going to use it, and this is really far out, but at least we found it. I think we can only get up to there. We made a mess. Don't tell me the toilets. Oh, it's grounded. It's grounded. Sorry. Unground. Unground. Whoops. Okay, I think that's cured the radiation, anyway. You missed the idle notification. I didn't even notice it's gone because I have the mod that removes it. So I hated the idle notification. I no, uh, not the idle one actually. Sorry, it was the long commutes. I don't. Yeah. I don't miss idle because yeah, it doesn't make much odds. Uh, is this head caretaker? Uh, head caretaker. I need to prioritize, please. The ranching, not the digging. It's true, but you can see if they're uh, stuck on there. Okay, let's see if we can nab these shovels. Wrangle them. They're all by the surface, which is quite useful, so... Nab them. <laughs> oh, nice. I mean, some radiation resistance tubes would, uh, would be... would be useful. Mm, unfortunately, they're all getting sunburned, which is not ideal. How many shelves we got in here now? Two? Just two? We're gonna we're gonna empty this planetoid of shovels. So I wonder if we can find any shovel eggs. But we 
Grab him. I'm guessing this guy can't be grabbed. Uh, if we just dig that, might be able to get him. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, radiation is, is quite annoying on these outer planetoids. I suppose either ones do, but any, any planetoids that you're doing rocketry on, you do get quite a lot of space rats. Mm -hmm. Okay, more. Get more. Uh, yeah, I don't think you can, Danathor. I think they. So it goes away after two cycles. Uh, it goes away after two cycles, but you know, to avoid it, you just have to. They have to not be outside for too long. Like they can be outside for a bit, but you can't leave them for too long. I think these guys have gone to bed. How many have we got so far? Uh, rooms overlay, which one's that? 11. Three critters, there we go. Soggy feet. Why have we got soggy feet? Oh, that's not good. Okay, I hope we're not overpressuring this. Okay, we are overpressuring this. Whoops. Is the cliff too big now? Uh, I don't think so. So they can climb down too, so as long as we keep this in twos, we'll be fine. It's one of those shuffles. Got free again. Okay, yeah, we overpressed a little bit, but fortunately this isn't anywhere near as bad as a normal rocket. Uh, episode time in a couple of minutes, Stevera, so thank you for reminding me. We're almost there, that's right. I got an eye on it. Got my eye on it. Wrangle, wrangle, wrangle. We can get him back. We're doing a smash and grab on the shovels. Here. Du -du -du. Oh, you don't. Okay. You need the. Um, you need the skill to wrangle them, but to actually move the trust ones, you don't need the skill, so... There you go. There you are. I couldn't remember which one was which. What have we got here? We should have a steam... Cool steam vent there. We've got two cool steam vents on this planetoid. That's actually... You could have 30 dupes on this planetoid. That's a lot. That's a lot. I mean, we're not going to do that. Please don't ask for that. But we could do that, in theory. On any run. Well, did you actually did you get two normally or one? I thought you normally got one, so it seems uh, additional to me. But I'm sure, there's no more shoves hiding around. You're going to get wrangled popping up like that. He literally popped right up the head caretaker. Nab him. Yep, and then we'll just scale up the other side of this cliff. This is a very low planetoid. Not a lot of backing here. Right. Oh, we put the fourth bed in. Oh, that's a grooming station, not a bed. Okay, I'm on. There we go. Right, copy that. We should now be able to take another dupe onto it there if we want. Bye. So we've got two shovels hiding on this side and five over here. Should we leave some behind? I don't know. Do you there's probably uh, shovel legs buried in, in some of these places, right? Or not? I don't know. Don't see a lot of buried items. I guess if they're like really far down, I'm not going to spend ages trying to get them. But we'll try. We'll grab as many as we can. What's going on? Right, skill, downtime, broken, resources, yeah, I know. Suppress that. Uh, yeah, we should probably grab some iron. We should, we should get on the iron one. Uh, that looks pretty good. Excavation. Doctoring or... Re no, that's even better. Wow, okay, that's a digger. 
That Abe is a digger. That's what we need. And uh, we're welcoming to the base. Uh, war cannon. There we go. Okay, building entombment solar panel. What the hell? How on earth did Regolith get up here? That's... I'm confused. How is that possible? Is that something coming over from next to this planetoid or something? I don't know, something weird. Something weird. Oh, but I've gone over the episode again. See, they very reminded me and I still forgot. Right, we'll, um, we'll leave it here for this episode. For YouTube, thank you guys very much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed. And I'll see you in the next one.